Hey, how's it going, everybody? It's your pal, Possible. I'm here. We're back in Mind Industry. We're doing the uh, version 6 campaign. Let's hop into Extraction Outpost here and just uh, see what's going on. We're probably going to die a horrible death. That's pretty much how it always goes. So, uh, you know, stuff happens. Apparently, we don't have that much. We have to get some... We got to get some glass coming. Let's do it for reals this time. This time, we got max stuffs. Let's do it. We should have all sorts of stuff here, so we should be good. Let's go ahead and launch it. Launch! We should have a big, uh, big head start on this one. Let's go ahead and, uh, you know, pause it for a moment. I want to get a feel for the map. Where is everything? This is an attack map. Okay. I didn't know this was an attack map. We keep having attack maps, and, uh, I, I don't tend to be the biggest fan of attack maps. Especially when I don't know what I'm doing. So uh, this will be interesting. Let me see what we're doing here. All right, first thing I think I'm going to want to do here is just at least wall ourselves off a little bit. Uh, this area right here is secure. We don't have to wall that. We just have to throw up a wall over here and wall off this little area over here. And definitely I'm going to try to get the titanium within that area because I think that's the only titanium we have. So we're definitely going to need that. So yeah, we're gonna have to try to wall it off like up here somehow. Uh, I was I was kind of trying to like wall it behind the water because I like the idea of forcing them to get shocked, but uh, you know sometimes it's not as easy to set that up. Maybe we can throw a wall right here and the rest of the wall like right here. Anyway, let's go ahead and start getting our mining going. We have a little copper going over here, but uh, we're gonna need some over here as well. Let me get rid of this stuff over there. That's our little copper node area. Let's go ahead and get some mines up. Hmm. Let's get some uh, pneumatic drills going. That'll give us a start at least. Something along those lines, I guess. That seems safe. We can we can make that work. Let's get all these built up. There we go. And do what the heck? Okay. For a second, I was like, where's my titanium conveyors? Well, I, I guess I don't have titanium yet, so I'm going to have to live with that for the time being. But that is not something I'm going to put up with for very long. So we're going to have to do something about that before too long. But honestly, with the copper lines here, we're going to saturate these before very long at all. So uh, I'm just going to bring these down like so. This one over here is just going to run parallel to it for now. We can put it into one line once we have uh, titanium going. All right, let's get this all built up. There we go. Let me see what we got over here. We don't want coal coming in soon, but I'm not going to work on that just yet. I want to get my titanium going. Yeah, I'm, I'm a big fan of getting titanium going. Just so uh, I don't have to drive myself crazy with the lack of conveyor belts. Uh... I guess that's about as the best we're going to do here. Okay, wait, this one I can't even get to. All right, let me see what we can do here. Yeah, okay, I don't think that one on top is worth it. Not for blocking it off. Let's go ahead and do like that. And we can access all of these, so that's fine. It's certainly better than the alternative. Let's go ahead and grab this and run it around here. Something along those lines there. There we go. Let me just go ahead and walk this on home. I'm going to try to leave the copper free. I might need it. I don't know. Copper is... Uh, lately, I've been having issues with copper. We'll see how that goes. I, I wish there was a nicer way to put this along the edge. Because I'll be honest with you, I'm not a fan of doing this little wiggle worm thing. Not a fan. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Bring it down like so. Oop. I need one more down. There we go. That'll work out. Let's get this all built up. We'll get that water cooled soon so we get more titaniums going. Let's work on getting our lead going. And then coal. How much graphite do I have on me? I'll make sure I'm not wasting too much of it. Oh, yeah, we're fine. All right. Let's go ahead and get these all going. This is an ugly lead area. That's all I can say. It's like, wow, this stuff is like all over the place. Yeah, we'll do something along those lines there. 
yeah, that's that's just that's an ugly lead area. There's not much I could do with that. You know, a lot of the stuff I do is ugly, and it's my fault. I'm gonna say this one. It was it was just made to be ugly. That's all there is to that one. All right, let's go up along the lines like that. And I think that's all I'll get with this line. Ivy come down and feed in. The rest of them will get fed with this one right here. Something along these lines here. You're supposed to be a junction, and I don't know why you didn't auto junction for me. So there we go. And I just saw some important things I apparently missed. For one, I'm going to have to bridge this to get this stuff over here. So let's bridge this from there to there. And just feed it into the line right here. That'll do it. That should be it. All right. That should be all set. So let's go ahead and run this across and down and then over. We're kind of using a lot of our inputs for this, but, you know, stuff happens. All right. So we have lead going. We have we have a line here that's like backwards. I made a line backwards, so we haven't been getting copper this whole time, and I just realized now. Wonderful. I love it when I do that. All right, so let's see what we're doing here. Uh, let's start getting our coal going. We're going to need as much coal as like possible here. And uh, I'm probably going to have to do weird things to facilitate that. Weird things that I'll never forgive myself for. I'm sure of it. Yeah, something like well, something along those lines. We're trying to make sure. Can I touch everything there? I think I can. Yeah, I think we're good for the most part here. Um, you know, I have to do weird things to make sure we can still have access to this. Do we have a good water spot I can uh, access over here? Uh, I mean, obviously, if water on the front line. I don't want to build too close to the front line. Like I was kind of hoping the water would stay on you know the far side of the wall there, just a little bit. We can grab water from down here and kind of. Spurt it around. Actually, I can grab water from right here. This is going to be a relatively safe spot. I can just throw some scatters up there to hold things off for the most part. So uh, let's get some mechanical pumps over here. Grab all this wonderful water from right here. And I, I know I'm going to want coal to be, like, cooled as much as possible, honestly. So let me see here. I'm going to throw down junctions wherever I think I can getting multiple uses out of them like there's actually a good spot get rid of that one this one's still going to need some i don't know it's uh it, it's not going to be the world's cleanest junction <laughs> job here there we'll do something like that oh man i'm gonna have to make like the world's ugliest lines here to make this all work but i'm trying to trying to do my best to make sure at least most of these are going to be water cooled that's the plan anyway. We'll see how that goes. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to junction like with crazy ugliest things in the universe here. Uh, but you know, hopefully it's worth it. Let me go ahead and junction back this way so I can start break off and hit things. It's gonna look a little bit like a spider web of some sort, of that much I can tell you. I guess, actually I better start getting coal out now while I have a moment. Because I do want to get some kind of defenses up at the very least starting out. Do I not have titanium yet? Like, why do, why, do, why can I not make titanium here? Did we, like, have we seriously not gotten any in yet? We didn't. Oh my god, it's been that long and we still didn't have any titanium in yet. That just seems crazy to me. Uh, let's go ahead and start getting some stuff out of here. Uh, getting all this out of here is going to be the world's ugliest job. But uh, I'm going to do what I can here at the very least. At least get some of it out because uh, we're going to need it to do all sorts of things really i'm just trying to you know leave myself room because i know we're going to need to get in here and, and get the uh get the water cooling everywhere but let's at least get some of the uh stuff out here oh my god we need more titanium we'll upgrade the titanium lines over here shortly we have to water cool all that over there as well for right now we have the coal we need i just want to get some uh can we get a steam generator? I don't know why I was looking in the wrong spot. Yeah, we got a steam generator. We can go ahead and do something like that. Let's go ahead and uh, for right now, we'll just have two little steam generators going. That'll hold us for a good long while, I'm pretty sure. And you know, for right now, I can I can take off of this and then 
kind of share it over here. We can get more water going in there without much of an issue. Let's go ahead and throw that there. Get this built up really quick. Have some of this coal come over here to feed this little area over here. I guess we're going to make it titanium. I'll oh, we'll just do something like that. And like that. There we go. So this should be producing. It is. Let's go ahead and get some uh, power nodes here. Uh, basically, I'm going to hold the front line with arcs if I can, because they're going to have water debuffs on them. Uh, you know, arcs with water debuffs are actually pretty decent. So uh, I don't mind, you know, relying on those for a little bit. Let me throw that like that. Throw down a couple of batteries. Something. I always like having at least something, just in case, you know, your power goes up out of nowhere. Y you got something. There. That should be backing up. I mean, we're not going to have the world's craziest amount of power here, but it should be something. Let's go ahead. Let me get rid of these rocks. I'm not a rock fan here. Get rid of that stuff. And we'll throw up the wall right along the uh, right along the water line, essentially. Uh, yeah, I'm going to make it out of copper for now, just because we don't have much uh, else. I'll throw you right there. Can I? Can I just do something? Uh, whatever, whatever I do is going to be kind of ugly, I guess. Eh, something like that. That'll work. Let's get that in here really quick. And we'll have to run off to the other side and get that going soon. I just want to get a couple arcs here to hold things off. Then we'll go to the other side and get things going. World's slowest builder. Getting some uh, builder help would be nice. We'll definitely be going heavy units uh, this map. I have like a weird hiccup thing there. Sorry about that. Uh, we'll definitely be going unit heavy because it's an attack map. It just seems like the way to go usually. I'm just going to kind of spread these around for now. We don't need too much coverage. This is super early in the uh, in the map, so they're not going to be hitting us with too, too much stuff right off the bat at least. I'm not even sure if most of this stuff is going to be in range. Are you in range? Yeah, it looks like they should be good. They got all the power they need. They don't have liquid, but, you know, stuff happens. They should be able to blow things up for the most part regardless. All right, let's go ahead and get this walled off over here. Kind of doing the same thing. Let's just throw this up like so. And the rest of this... Can I, actually, I can actually build over that. That doesn't make sense that we could. But anyway, for here, we're just going to go something like that-ish. I guess we're doing that. Not a big fan of that, but that's what we're doing. So say we all. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I guess we can throw some uh, arcs over there, too, if they really want to go that way. I'd rather them stick on our front line over here, but they don't usually do exactly what you want them to do. That's one thing I've learned in this game. They kind of just do what they want when they want. I'll throw a line over here just so they can't be shot through that little area there. All right, we got stuff here. Let's throw down some arcs. Just to hold the line, really. I like that they're all going to naturally have a wet buff, uh, debuff rather, which means we're not going to have to do much to uh, hurt them pretty good. We just have to get some power over here. We'll be able to hold the front line for a long while. A long, long while. There we go. Let's put that on pause for now. And let me see. We need to move some power over here and we can woo I didn't want I wanted I wanted these ones not not the big scary ones uh, not that it makes that much of a difference really but it's actually probably more efficient to use the big ones especially if you're uh, just traveling and not hooking things up like I am but you know I'm, I'm a goober I like doing things my own goober way you want to actually connect there we go so everything should have power everything should be wonderful and, uh, yeah, you got power, you're going. You got power, you're going. All right. Uh, we could probably liquid cool these later on, but I'm not really all that worried about it, at least for now. Let's get some uh, get some Mender coverage down. I like Mender coverage. Menders allow me to be lazy, and I am all about that. Can I just throw it here and cover, like, everything? I think that'll cover that one up there. I'm not 100%. We'll find out really soon if it can or not. Like, do you reach up there? 
yeah, it's flashing. So yeah, it actually covers all the way up there. So we have a whole bay, a whole area covered with just these two things. I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, we're just gonna have to throw. Hopefully, get one of them to cover this little area over here. Can we can we do it with just one? It doesn't look like we can do it with just one. There's gonna be a little bit of missing here. So stuff happens. Let's just throw it down like that. That'll cover both areas here. We'll just have to live with it. Let's watch these guys die a horrible death. That'll make me happy. You gonna get in close or what, buddy? There you go. That's how you die for me. Alright, so now let's actually start getting to working on our liquid cooling of coal. Because basically we're going to need to make the most out of this coal that we can. Because that's uh, that's pretty much all we got uh, in our little area here. And I'm going to need that for like everything, pretty much. Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, can we upgrade this line yet? Can we just... You want to do that? Is that... Yeah, that's that's replacing all of them. That works for me. What, can you go all the way over here? No, it only goes there. Fair enough. Upgrade all that to titanium. I just want to get titanium in faster. That'd make me happy. And apparently, if you keep it on the line like that, it actually replaces it and lets you keep everything on the line. So that's nice. It's nice to have. Uh, here we could upgrade a lot of this stuff so it only can takes one line uh, but we're not forced to right now we're not in a dire straits with having to make things fit so i'm not all that worried about it we'll be good for now i'm not quite sure if this guy's getting healed by that i can't tell i don't think that he actually is so we'll, we'll have to keep an eye on him see make sure he doesn't get beat up on too bad all right i said i was going to do more liquid cooling things and then i got sidetracked so let's go back to doing that. I'm going to throw some more uh, rotary pumps on there. be nice to have better pumps, maybe. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. We can use the uh, pulse conduit, I guess, if we really wanted to upgrade this. We're going to use this water for like just about everything, so why not? Let's do something like that. And uh, upgrade this going this way. It doesn't need to be upgraded here because we're not going to be using that much, but, you know, whatever. There. Paul's conduit. We should be transferring water much faster. Very good. Very, very good. I'm uh, fighting myself because I want to get uh, air defense up. And I keep thinking, oh, they're not going to come and hit us with it yet. But you never know when they are. Do we have scrap in the area? Or am I going to have to waste my lead putting it into, uh, into whatchamacallits, into uh, scatters? Words are hard sometimes, I'm telling you. So we need lead... And, uh, whatchamacallit, we need lead and sand to make glass, isn't it? Pretty sure. Yeah, lead and sand to make metaglass. We're not even making graphite yet. Oh my god, and I've been spending it like everything. Ah, uh, alright. I need to stop getting sidetracked. Everything is sidetracking me. Alright, let's go ahead and st still work on our uh, water pr uh, production over here. Let's uh, move this on down this way. And I think I'm just going to bridge that over. Yep, bridge to there. And uh, we're going to do something similar over here. Go like that. Bridge you over to there. Throw you in like that. And that should get all this water working. So you should be all watered up over here. You are, and I have to make sure we actually get this stuff out momentarily. We're just not there yet. All right, let me see here. We're going to have to break off some stuff over here. Let me break down from like, I don't know. I'll throw in a router maybe here and then work our way around. I don't want to try to fix a router in through here. Then I kind of block off what very little room I have over there. So let me see what we can do here. Let's run it on down this way. I guess I'll jump it there. Why not? We can make it happen. There we go. From here, we run over here, and then up here, and then over here somewhere, and we'll, we'll make all this work somehow. One way or another, all that stuff will work. I just want to make sure I get the, uh, the groundwork laid down for us here. All right, so we're going to have to get water over here. Kind of want to move this one right here. Where that is doesn't really particularly matter, as long as it's just... 
somewhere we could use it. Let me stop wasting all my water everywhere. I tried to leave a little bit of room for ourselves in there because we can get in there with a, uh, whatchamacallit, with a conveyor, which we're going to need to. Uh, let me see here. We're going to need to put a... Ew, that's my only spot open to even access to this one. So that sucks, but I can't cover it. And that's actually the same same issue with this one right here. Uh, anywhere else where I have that issue, I didn't realize. Not yet. All right. So we know that this area right here is going to need to be, be left alone. Uh, same with at least this block right here. So now we know. I didn't know, of course, as you guys can tell, I didn't really plan any of this out really efficiently at all. I kind of was just like, okay, where can I shove stuff? And yeah, it kind of sort of works sometimes. We'll see how that goes. Let me see. We can get... Maybe I'll just run you up. You can connect there. You can connect there. And let me see. We have to start grabbing out of here. I guess you can go like that. Where else can we grab? We're going to have to grab out of this one somehow. I think we're going to go like that and then bridge it on over this way. And then grab it over here. Okay. Yeah, we're going to have to grab it like that. Then I will go ahead. You're supposed to go down. I could have swore I did that. And we're going to have to bridge conveyor it from here to there. And then that should all work. Maybe? Where's this one going? This one has to go down somewhere. I don't know where this one is going. Something has to go somewhere, though. I think I'm just going to throw this. Let's start making some bridges for it. I'm going to have to bridge it there to there to there. Connect over here. And what exactly we're going to do with this right now, I don't know. But we got stuff there if we want it. I kind of, uh, I know we're going to need lots and lots and lots of coal, so I'm glad we have it. We just don't need it yet. Uh, not as much as we have, anyway. But anyway, this should all mostly be liquid-cooled, kind of, sort of, mostly. This one's not feeding out anywhere. We have to do something about that. Uh, okay, I think you're going to have to go from here to there. And do you feed out there or anything? What if I go like that? There. Alright, we're getting attacked by something or another. They should die pretty quick. Yeah, they, they didn't last very long. All right, we have coal going. We should uh, make graphite with that coal. Do we have a graphite, large graphite press? No, I, I guess we just have to use the regular graphite press. All right, we'll just have to live with it. Uh, for right now, I think I'll just do something. Do something like that. I don't know how many of those we can saturate. Probably not all of them, but I figured why not. Let's do some overflows on here. Feed it on over like so. Not the most space efficient build in the world, I know, but stuff happens. And there we go. We should be getting graphite in momentarily. There we go. That should go pretty good. Are we actually keeping this saturated? I guess we could add more onto it. I'm not all that worried about it, but let's just add one more. Yep, let's do it. Let's do it. Just throw in an overflow right there. That'll do it. If that's not enough graphite for us, I don't I don't know what to say. That should that should definitely be enough graphite for us. Alright. Now, I said I wanted to upgrade these lines over here with titanium, and we finally have titanium to do it. So let's work on that. Can I make this actually? Yeah, there we go. That at least can get upgraded. Like so. I'm not entirely sure all these would actually fit in one line without issues. If I'm being honest. We'll have to, we'll have to see how that works. Let's at least get that built really quick. Hopefully keep everything on our line here. I'll try shoving it into one line and we'll see how it goes. And uh, if it doesn't work, well then, then we know it doesn't work.
<laughs> That's pretty much all there is to it. So let me just throw that like that. And we'll see. Do you all go on one line without issues? It, it seems to. Yeah, it's, it's going on one line without any issues at all. So we'll go ahead, let all this stuff feed in there, and then we'll get rid of this line, essentially. Go ahead, line. There we go. All right, it's very nice. Titanium works so much better than the... Uh, than the copper line, that's for sure, which means we can do the same thing over here, essentially. Let's go ahead and uh, I think I'll get rid of this. I won't get rid of it because I'll be upset with myself if I do, but for one thing we're going to do is we're going to definitely consolidate here. And I think what you're going to do is come down like this and then feed in. Let's go ahead and upgrade these little lines here. Like so. And that should be this little area here all maxed out. And we got a monster coming in somewhere. I'm not all that worried about it. They could send a lot of stuff and we'd be completely fine. All right. Do we have this one? All right, I can get rid of this one at least somewhat now. There we go. It's, it's totally gone now. Upgraded lines for the win. Yeah, they haven't even made it to us yet. I'm going to throw down a couple more arcs just for funsies. I'm really not worried about them hitting us with too much stuff right now. I kind of just, being that we have the water right here, I'll probably go crazy on arcs here. Because electricity over water just seems like a no-brainer. We can go down a couple of uh, Lancers down or something. Uh, I don't think we can make Surge Alloy or anything, so we can't do like Surge Alloy craziness. But, you know, we'll be fine. You want to shoot that guy, please? Don't give him free hits. Shoot his butt. There we go. He kind of exploderated. I'm a fan of that. Uh, let's go down over here. We'll throw down a couple more arcs over here as well. They're not even hitting over here very much, if at all. I'm not entirely sure they've come over here at all, if I'm being honest. But we'll have them here, just in case. I wonder if they're sitting in the water, if they kind of water cooled. I guess not. It just seemed like they're right there in the water. It should kind of count. I'm just saying it should kind of count. All right, let's see. Let's get some scatters. I, I, let me get some metaglass going. That's what I want to get going. Just in case. Oh, we're definitely not we're definitely not saturating this over here now. For right now, I'm gonna throw an overflow and have this feed over there. This is not going to be a long-term solution, but for now, no reason not to use all that coal we got. Just do something with it. So hopefully that'll work out. We have everything else feeding down. I think we have everything feeding down properly. So yeah, we just have so much coal we can't do anything with it here. That's okay. At least we're getting graphite out of it now. Let's go ahead and work on getting... This is like all our lead here. Alright, we're going to have to divert some of this lead at the very least to... Uh... Yeah, we don't have lead anywhere else. I might have to liquid cool this to get more out of it. Then I'm looking at it. Do I want to do that? Oh my god, it's going to be so ugly. I don't want to do it, but I feel like we kind of have to. I'm not going to do it now, but we might do it later. Alright, let's go ahead and work on getting some metaglass coming in here. And I'm just going to throw that probably just right over here. It seems like a good place we can... There's a decent place we can siphon stuff off of without getting into a mess. I think I'm just going to throw it here. We'll just have... Actually, I, I doubt we're going to even saturate too. I'm not going to use a full line for this. I think what I'm going to do is grab this line here and just shove it up there. And then overflow it back into the, into the line. Something like that. So we'll take... That's not exactly... I don't know. My brain's not working at the moment. Don't mind me. Get rid of that thing. Have this run up this way. It's not exactly what I want it to do. Let me try this again. Have it run up this way. Something like that. I'll just overflow back down, essentially. Is all I was looking to do. Something like that. There we go. That's exactly what I wanted. And let's go feed this over here. We're going to have to get some sand for this. But getting sand in the middle of the desert is uh, not something I think we'll have much trouble with. I guess we'll do a little zipper pattern there. Uh, let's go ahead and get some stuff out here. Where this comes from, I don't particularly care. I'm just going to throw down a couple of these here. And that should honestly be adequate for what we're doing. Let's grab this. Come over this way. Actually, let's run this on down instead of going up. We'll do something like that. 
There we go. Run you down here. That should work. Let's go ahead and get a zipper going. There we go. Feed in. And that should be functioning. I might have to get more sand going. We'll see how it goes. We'll get a little bit of uh, meta glass coming out here. At least some. And uh, we're going to feed that into some scatters, I think. That'll be what we do. I'll probably throw it up. I don't know. Throw some over here. Throw some over here. Throw some over here somewhere. Maybe back in here. I don't know. Let me get a couple scatters down and see where I like them. Maybe I'll throw like... Do a little six stack there. Same over here. Something like that. And I don't know why I can build on this deeper water here, but I'll do it if they're going to let me do it. There we go. And maybe one over here. Something like that. All right, so we're going to have to build all those and get metaglass to them. This shouldn't be the end of the world. We're not going to be making all that much metaglass that I'm looking at it. We're gonna have to, I'm going to have to beef up our input there. And that's okay. Uh, being that we don't have much lead, I, I'd at least um, be throwing meta glass with the lead we have as opposed to just throwing pure lead. It just doesn't seem worthwhile. I'm trying to see what what they're doing over here while still being able to build. Are we going to blow them up? Are they going to get bloated up? Yeah, they got bloated up pretty easily. <laughs> no complaints. Alright, let's see what we can do with the meta glass here. I think we're going to break it into two lines. One going over here, one going over there. Uh, first, let's actually get electricity over here. That would help. And I should probably check and make sure that we actually have enough electricity for everything. I haven't actually checked our electricity in a long time. What are we at? We're still at plus 220, so we're, we're fine for the most part. Just double checking. Uh, let's grab the meta glass out of here. Bring it to center. And for now, I'll probably just router it to split it. Some of it going this way, some of it going over here. For now, this is going to go over this way. How can I get this over here without being a mess? Okay, I think I can do something along the lines of like this. And then jump it over that one. Yeah. I hope they don't make me get uh, stuff in the line for doing this. Sometimes weird stuff happens like that. We'll see momentarily if we actually end up with uh, stuff we don't want in the line. It's running up here like that. Actually, I think the upgate made it so you can put overflows next to uh, stuff to feed it now. We'll find out really quick. Does it work now? Do overflows work to feed things? They do. Okay, they, they didn't used to. But they seem to now, so that's good. Happy with that. Alright, let's run another line... I guess we split it here. We'll go up over this way. And we might have to run it through this little area here. I don't know. We'll, we'll see how things go. For now, let's just run it alongside this line. And... Do I run it, run it down the bottom here? I guess I could fit it through there. I think there's no real reason for me to force that to fit there. So let's not force it if we don't have to. And that way I can run it right by this line over here, which I'm going to need to do anyhow. There we go. And let me see here. We can still force it through here. That's fine. Not the end of the world. Yeah, do something like this. And then up. That'll work. Let's do some overflows on here. Yeah, that'll work. That functions. I guess these aren't going to get fed at all unless I throw a router in there instead. I think at the end of the day, I just quite simply need to be putting more stuff in here than I am. All right, let, let's let's unoverflow it right there instead of just send you straight on over. There we go. Actually, now I have that I have things set up in the weirdest way. So this goes straight up. There, there you go. And uh, we'll throw an overflow here just in case, but I don't think it's going to be an issue. If, if anything, I want more lead to be going here than what is currently coming through. Uh, let me see here. Is there more, more lead I can siphon off somewhere? 
I don't know. I think we have more lead coming through than uh, sand anyway. Let's work on that real quick. Even just that will probably help. What's going on over here? None of that shooting at my stuff stuff. Yeah, we're definitely going to feed up here as well. I think I'm going to ratter feed some of these uh, just because I can't rely on overflow to actually feed these things. Because I just don't have enough stuff on the line and I'd rather actually make sure we at least get some on some of these things. Uh, let's go ahead. I think I'm going to ratter off of this. Come this way. Just to feed the ones we have coming up through here. Like Sue. So. And uh, I guess these we can overflow because it doesn't much matter. There we go. We'll throw a mender over here. If I can. Just to heal up all this stuff over here. Let's get some power over there. Keep that going. There we go. This should all function soon, hopefully. Hopefully we have enough power for all this. I think we do. What's our power looking like? Plus 150. We're still doing okay. So we have anti-air covered. Or at least we will have it covered shortly. So that's good. And I think what I'm going to do... I'll have the overflow from this just go into our uh, into our base down here. Are we actually going to get, it, get much out of it? Probably not. Probably not at all, to be honest. But we'll have it at least... It'll, I think we'll definitely at least keep up with the uh, the ammo, I'm hoping. Anyway, guys, we're going to end this one here. I'm sorry things have been so slow, but trying to get us set up here. We have a decent defense set up. Uh, now we're going to have to start focusing on offense, essentially. Just uh, start working on drone production and whatnot. Anyhow, this game is Ministry. If you guys are interested, I have a link down in the description. We play this on the channel an awful lot, so uh, if you're into this kind of stuff, why don't you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Click that bell icon so you know when I put out new content. Smash that like button, leave a comment down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.